what this event, you know, sort of means to you and, you know, what it's like being in the first class for the Montana Football Hall of Fame. Well, first, it's, a, it's an honor, absolutely honored to be a part of the first class. Uh, this event is, is amazing because uh, it's something that's very much needed. Mm -hmm. And just to show, you know, some of the past, some of the history of, of what Montana football is all about. And, to have something like this is, is incredible. Mm -hmm. What is, you know, that kind of legacy of Montana football? What does it mean to you, and what do you think it ultimately means to the people who live here? Well, it's one of the sports that everyone uh, grows up playing and um, has some sort of involvement in one way or another, whether mm -hmm. it be coaching or have family members or something like that. Uh, it's, it's, it's one of the sports that Montanans uh, take pride in. There's, there's a ton of uh, talent that, that, that is here that sometimes goes unrecognized uh, in the rest of the country. But uh, in recent years, it's, uh, we've shown that Montana has, has a lot of ability in, right. on the highest stage. For you, for your football career, what stands out more, high school, college, or the professional? Uh, I would say college. Uh, college just because that's where I got a lot of my um, – foundation in football mm -hmm. you know you know high school is, is is all about offense all about yourself you know and, and you try you try to win state championships but a lot of times at that age you're, you're so immature that mm -hmm. um, you need a lot of a lot of coaching and a lot of a lot of things like that but I, I feel like um, in college that's where that's where football really transformed who I was as an individual it gave me all the things that uh, that football produces you know character perseverance mm -hmm. hard work a lot of those things and, and uh, I'll never forget those those times during the when I played for the University of Montana mm -hmm. and what are kind of some of the memories that stand out most for you from your playing days at UM? you know uh, the memories that stand out the most for me are probably uh, just the relationships that I built with the guys you know the locker room scene is just uh, I'll never forget the conversations that we had you know we were all at one time or another counseling one another uh, so we're all counselors we're all we're all brothers and, and, and those conversations and those relationships are, are really what matter at the end mm. of the day okay do you think your teammates you know kind of helped you as you you know you talk about how it kind of developed you as a football player do you think your teammates had that locker room conversation do you think that kind of helped you going forward Absolutely.